With load shedding as it is in South Africa today, the question is not if you need a power system or a backup power system, it's when you'll need one and which one you should buy. I'm Jonathan Palmer, Director of Powerman. And the big decision you need to make is do you go for a UPS like we have over here or do you go for an inverter? Both have their advantages and both have their disadvantages. With a UPS, which is an online UPS, you will clean up the power before passing it on to the equipment. So imagine if you're driving down a road in South Africa with our favorite potholes. That is what's happening to your car is probably what's happening to your computer equipment while it's running from the ESCOM mains. Uh, ESCOM mains has dips, spikes and surges and this is damaging your equipment. A UPS will regenerate the power and make sure you have clean power. 230 volts coming out constantly. An inverter on the other hand is only designed to switch over once you have a power failure. So you will travel on that same road all the way until such time as the power fails you will then switch to a diverted path, which will be a clean path. But as soon as the mains comes back, you will switch back to the original road that you were on. So a UPS will certainly give you a much cleaner uh, path for your computer equipment to travel on, whereas a inverter will not do that for you. Uh, these units will be excellent for house lighting or, or those type of applications, but we would not recommend these in a computer application.